Hope you girls like this. Good morning, modern steaders. I don't want to rub it in too much, but it's 45 degrees out this morning, and I'm loving it. Oh, this weather is the best. This is why we moved to northern New Hampshire. We're not supposed to be in the 90s and 90 degrees at night. Boy, they're noisy. I got you a hay feeder yesterday for inside the barn. Is you saying thank you? You're welcome. I've been very happy with how their hay feeders have been working. It's, they eat most of the hay. It stays pretty clean. This is going to be the first time that I clean it out. wouldn't clean it out at all, but the little babies like to stand up in here. It shouldn't be too long and Blossom and Buttercup won't be able to fit in here. That's not for you to eat. Figaro coming to check you out. Here he comes. You better watch out. Alright, now we can give him some fresh hay. Do you want that? Oh, Blossom. Alright, so the easiest way to do this would be like that. I think that's too high for the goats. We have to cut some scrap wood to go here and there so we can mount it like that high. gonna be kind of guessing the height but we can always change it if we need to I think something like that should be good now when I was trying to find an inside hay feeder rack for the goat barn I can find a lot of the big metal up and down bar ones and to me that's more for horses because they can pull out big clumps the goats I would think they'd make a big mess with that so we wanted this style, and I passed it up when we were at one feed store. Then I was searching online, they were like 95 bucks. I had to wait till we went back to the original feed store, and at that feed store they had them for 35 bucks. And if you search online for a rugged ranch, you can find them for the same price. I was wondering how the goats got in. We were trying to sneak up on you. You did till the goats came in. I was like, how'd they open the door? Ah, oh, you think there's something good up there, don't you? How about we try out the new hay feeder? Are you running out? I'm not. I'm waiting for the goats. Get off there. Come on. Come on. Well, uh, what do you think you're doing? No. Come on. Out of the milking parlor. Let's go. You too. Out. There you go, buttercup. Perfect height, huh? Oh, how cute. Are you guys so cute? You enjoying the cooler weather this morning? It's nice, isn't it? Where's sausage hiding? Oh, you're silly. I didn't even see you over there. Are you doing? 
Don't touch the fence. Two sad things, uh oh. There's a perfect little tomato down. Oh man. And then there was one that was eaten. Eaten? Like pecked at or? And then I saw a chicken poop. Then you saw a chicken poop. Oh, them damn chickens. So, we did get in there. Miss Olivia might want to check her strawberries. I have to wash my hands. Chickens get another one. Did you find any more chicken poo? Just one. I picked it up. We're not gonna let them have it. We'll give it to the pigs. Yeah, that was naughty. You guys aren't having it. Them buggers. <laughs> There's no red strawberries right there. Like none. There was yesterday, so the chickens must have gotten there yeah. too. Like they were small, tiny red ones that you wouldn't have wanted, but it was loaded with them. Yeah, there's no strawberries in here. Yeah, there's Oh, there is this plant and like little leaves for some reason. Them I ordered a GoPro Karma drone the other day. And I want to take a minute to thank all the people that support us on Patreon and who have bought some of our t-shirts. I've been able to save the money up from the Patreon supporters and from the t-shirt sales to buy that drone. So we should be getting that within a few days to a week. So that's going to be awesome. And thanks everybody for your support. Thank you. Them little buggers. I just cleaned that out this morning too. Gave them fresh hay. You're not going to fit pretty soon. Mr. I know, Pissy. that's what I was saying this morning. Pretty soon it won't be able to fit anyway. Or at least block them. Buttercup's still tiny. Yeah, I'm going to wrap this up. I'm Hey, you're fogging up the lens there. Hopefully they play with the ball as much as they're playing with these chunks of wood. Yeah, why do they like wood? I don't know. Okay guys, I have one lap. I just have one lap. You have to take turns. You have to take turns. Oh, don't chew my shirt. No, no. Okay. Okay. Say, good morning, guys. Oh, that's all. <laughs> Stop eating my ring. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you guys are cute. How come you're so cute? Huh? How come you're so cute? Say, because I am. Hey, save a size forever. Hope you girls like this. would probably like it, but they don't like food. Break the ball.
up in the ball. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're on. I got you a present and I think it's better than flowers. Oh yeah. Yeah, I do. I'd rather have it over flowers and it'll last longer. Poop picker upper? A pink poop picker upper. <laughs> just a new handle. Uh, just a new head. Awesome. You like that, Willow? It's gonna pick up Watch your, your poop. <laughs> I thought you'd be more excited over that. That's like huge. Willow does. Hey, don't eat it. No, you can't eat your poop picker upper. Oh no, don't leave me. I got to trade you in. So what can we do to get our goats to play with the jolly ball? You leave it in the attention because they did do it for a second. I ain't seen them. Well, the camera was not can we me. spray it with a scent or something to get them more active with it? Do they like peanut butter? That's what I was wondering, if you could put something like peanut butter or something else on it. You gotta be careful, I don't know what they're doing. What are you doing, Andy? I gotta get the York rake out of the back of my truck. This shark rake I bought probably back in 2013, 2014. When we lived in Massachusetts, we had about an acre and a half and two acres cleared. And we did the same thing with this tractor and with the York rake that we're gonna do here. I remember the first or the second time I set up the York rake, I pinched my finger good. I don't remember if it was trying to take off one of these bars or if it was one of these string-loaded clips that got my thumb, but man, I was cursing. And that hurt for a week or two. Ugh. I look out class. end today's video we got another wedding to go to so hope you guys had a great weekend and we'll see you in the next video bye, bye. bye.